Hey guys, this is our 2023 trip to Dublin, Ireland. We stayed at the Hyatt Centric in the Liberties area of Dublin. It's right there on the map. This is Penny Bridge. We went in February of 2023. Weather wasn't super bad, but it was pretty cold. We're from LA, so not really used to the cold like that. We stayed on the south side of the banks. Right here where I'm standing is the north. We went to grab some breakfast at JK Cafe. This is a full Irish breakfast. The beans were actually pretty good with the breakfast. This is our walk to the Temple Bar. Probably one of the most touristy things you can do in uh, Dublin, Ireland. All the locals said, don't go there, don't go there. But of course we had to go. It was pretty packed, a bunch of people. This is 11 in the morning on a Saturday. They had live music going on, which was pretty cool. But the drinks were expensive and that's why the locals were telling us not to go there. After the Temple Bar, we walked around Trinity College. Unfortunately, I didn't buy tickets to see the Book of Kells, but we just uh, walked around the campus, explored. It's a beautiful campus. After we left Trinity College, we just started walking around and uh, stumbled upon Powers Court. It's a little shopping center with uh, little stores and some restaurants. It's really cute inside. And then we kept walking. This is the end of Grafton Street. And we found St. Stephen's Green Shopping Center. It was really nice inside. We just decided to stop and take a little break from all the walking. If you're thinking about taking a trip to Dublin, I would suggest not to rent a car. I would just walk around everywhere. It's pretty easy and it's pretty small. They do have taxis and Ubers and they have another app called Free Now that you could use to get around. Me and my wife walked around pretty easily and we felt pretty safe. We went to the Jameson Distillery. We uh, grabbed a little drink before our cocktail making class. This is what the inside looks like. And then this is our cocktail making class. There was about 20 people inside our class. Um, we made a couple drinks. We made a rhubarb sour and uh, old fashioned. The rhubarb sour was amazing. The class was really fun. So if you get a chance to do it, I really suggest it. And then we made our way over to the Guinness storehouse. Lots of drinking going on today. And at the Guinness storehouse, they do this really cool thing where you take a photo and uh, they'll put the photo on your beer. So that's me and my wife enjoying our beer, checking out our photo. And this is the top of the Guinness storehouse. By this time, I'm like 10 drinks in, so kind of feeling it a little bit. I would definitely suggest not to do Jameson and Guinness on the same day right after each other. Don't make my mistake. After there we went to have dinner at the church. It's a restaurant slash bar that used to be a church. Please excuse the dirty napkins. The following day after all that drinking we decided to check out St. Patrick's Cathedral. We did a self-paced audio tour. It's a really beautiful church. It's really close to where we're staying. It's right next to the Liberties. So 
it's probably less than a block away from our hotel so it was a really easy walk over there and it was just full of historical artifacts and it was really interesting to walk around so I highly suggest checking out St. Patrick's Cathedral if you have the chance. This is the outside of the church. There's a small park surrounding the church. And then we walked over to the Dublin Castle. I think tickets were only like $8 to do a tour. It's not that big. not a must see in my opinion you could skip it if you want but it was all right if you guys are planning a trip to dublin I would suggest staying at most three days. We stayed about five days in total and I feel like we kind of ran out of things to do. If you do have the opportunity, I would suggest driving to the other side of Ireland on the north end to check out the cliffs. We had a lot of people suggesting to do that. And then on our last day, we checked out the Tilling Distillery. It was pretty close to our hotel, so we just decided to walk over there. It was like a maybe 10 minute walk so that was our trip to dublin ireland now we're on our way to london please check out for that video thank you guys for watching please like and subscribe mm -hmm.